Now then YouTube, I'm the Tough Man and welcome to a quick update guys on what's going to go on on my channel, channels uh, over Christmas and the new year. Now for all of you guys out there that are wondering what's going to happen to my channel over the new year, over Christmas, well I simply don't know, it really depends on what type of time I get over Christmas, but I can say some things for certain guys, tomorrow is Christmas Eve and there are videos going to go up on Christmas Eve, let me just have a quick gander. Uh, uh, at this quick gander on my first channel um, there is of course going to be uh, I think I've got it might have to record that tonight uh, there's going to be an episode of FIFA and uh, on my second channel there is going to be the uh, 7 days to die another part of that one that should have gone up over the weekend guys but unfortunately I've been a bit too busy to be able to get that done um, that being said guys I'm going to drink water. I'm, I'm going off Chub now. I'm like, yes, I must leave Chub alone for a little while. So, Christmas Day, there's going to be no videos on Christmas Day. As always, guys, you know, I spend it with the family, I spend it with the kids, and uh, we're going out and we're going to be so busy that I'm just never going to get time to do anything. Um, now, that also means that over the course of Christmas, recording things is going to be a lot more difficult as well. The kids are at home from school and uh, everything's going to be hectic, it's going to be chaos over the Christmas period. I'm going to go down and see family over the Christmas period and before, you know, New Year, um, of course, it's New Year's Eve. After that, I would think that regular uploads will begin in the New Year rather than suit, you know, rather than before that because I've got to pre-record my bits and bobs um, for a, a, another week ahead and I haven't got anything pre-recorded because I've been so busy getting stuff ready and stuff sorted and stuff done that I just haven't had the time to be able to do that. So over Christmas there's not going to be many videos out however there's a lot of videos still there for you guys to go and catch up on if you, you do want to catch up on them that is. Um, my Journeyman series, you guys will see this, my Journeyman series is, um, I don't know, it's come to a halt because there are no jobs available for me to go to. And I, I could stay with Bordeaux, but I don't want to stay with Bordeaux. The whole premise of it is the fact that, uh, you know, I'm going out there and I'm going to be a journeyman and I'm moving on. If I can't move on if there's no jobs and I do stay at Bordeaux until next year, what happens if at the end of that year, again, there's going to be no jobs? It's a, you know, I'm in, a, I'm in a bit of a pickle. Now, if I can't move on, um, my choice is that I'm not going to carry on with the journeyman because it, do, it it ceases to become what the name is. It ceases to become a journeyman. I don't go anywhere. So I then have to think about what I'm going to go ahead and do in the future for a simulated career mode because, I, you know, the simulated career modes on my channel are doing better than what my actual career mode is. So I would like to do a simulated career mode. I do have an idea in my head of what I want to do um, and I, I reckon that I might go ahead and give that a try if... And it's a big if I can't find another job with Bordeaux. If I can't find another job and move on from Bordeaux, then I will go ahead and do this separate series of, uh, of a simulated manager mode. Because it's something that I really want to do, actually. I want to, want to try this out and see if it works. Um, now, things that I've noticed. Things that I've noticed. People make suggestions, people make comments and stuff like that that I can't implement because I sit down and do three recordings of Journeyman in one day. So I don't get those suggestions and those uh, you know, points that you make until I get to the end of you know the the week and then you know that you guys have done that and then I can sit down and do another three recordings with your guys' suggestions. Now three episodes in Journeyman is a long bloody time. So that you guys are giving me suggestions at the start of the series, uh, at the start of the season, and I can't implement them until the season's nearly finished. So it's you know that's a little bit of a problem as well. But if I have if I'm not on a Journeyman and if I'm doing something different on simulated career mode, those suggestions are still valid going into the seasons coming. So I w I want to give this other one a try. I want to give this other one a try. Now for those of you guys who are involved in the live stream, will know exactly what I want to do with my Luton Town career mode, and that is to make it into a highlighted career mode. It is literally, and I must stress this. I must stress this. It's a test to see how it goes down, to see how well it fares, to see what I can do with that and how many episodes I can get that of that out a week um, and so on and so forth. And I want to see what kind of reaction that I do get from my subscribers. I mean, it's all well and good, guys. And I was, say, I was saying this to the, uh, the you know, the, the, the stream. It's all well and good having the six and 700 people who regularly come and watch my videos, my uh, Luton Sound career mode. I did ask them people, I said, look, if I change that, would the six and seven hundred people that are there would they disappear, thinking, "Oh, this guy's just like just like everybody else now?" And uh, you know, the general consensus is that 
people do like the full full size career mode, the full games of the career mode. Um, however, I don't get a lot done, and I, I regularly, you know, I've got a brilliant youth system with uh, with Loot and Sound now, and we're never going to see the fruits of that come to to bear because. I just never get enough time to be able to get towards the end of the season. So I want to see if I can do that. I want to see if I can do that. Would these guys be still around if I did highlight a career modes? The general consensus on the live stream was yes. You know, people will still watch me because it's still me behind the camera. It's still me on the uh, the, the face cam there. It's still me that are doing the voiceover, voiceovers. It's still me doing all that kind of good stuff, you know, with my, with my kind of, you know, look on it. Um... The other thing is that it also, it would be less stressful on myself as well. It would be less stressful on myself. When I am doing full-on matches and commentating throughout the, the whole of the match, I have to constantly find something in which to talk about. And I showed people on the stream and I said, this is how I normally play FIFA. If I'm sat at home by myself on my chair, no recording software going on, this is how I play FIFA. It was dead. It was barren. There was nothing. I didn't say anything. I hardly made any kind of comment at all. I mean, it was some bullshit that happened and it, of course, you know, I have to vent that kind of bullshit and I have my own little bits and bobs that I do say in there, but for vast majority of that game, I did not say a word, because that's the way I normally say uh, play FIFA. When I find myself having to constantly go commentate over the top of a match, I keep finding things to pick on rather than finding things to to have a laugh at. I keep finding things to pick off. Okay, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. Get that out of my face. Get that out of my face. This is crap. Look at this. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. And I can't believe this. And all oh, this game's shit. I can't believe it. It's not working. This ain't doing it. Why are you passing over there? Why are you not? So I, I constantly find myself whinging about the game rather than enjoying the game. And I swear to God, if I do highlighted career modes, there are going to be periods in the game where I don't say anything. And I don't feel the need to have to say anything because that can just be chopped out. You know what I mean? And highlighted career, I'm not saying that highlighted career modes are going to turn into this, oh, I'm only going to show goals. That's not the case at all. I am going to show close calls. I'm going to show good bits of play and so on and so forth. I'm not going to just be showing goals. And it's still going to be me live commentating on it. It's just chopped up instead. I'm going to give that a try for after Christmas into the new year, guys, because I want to see how it goes. I think that that has to happen on my channel for it to continue to grow now. I went on to Legendary, and I tried it on Legendary, and whilst it is fun, and whilst the challenge is there, the the, the people that come back and watching it every week, you know, day in, day out, aren't, it's not going anywhere, it's not going back up, I'm not growing again. I think that the only way of doing that is to change it back into a, well, not change it back, to change it into a highlighted career mode. I don't know what you guys think. Let me know in the comment section below if you think that if I do go into a highlighted career mode, would you still be there watching it, uh, you know, along with uh, along with whoever it is that's going to come in and watch it as well? Would you still be there, the long-time subscribers of mine, the long-time viewers of mine, would you still be there to watch that? And uh, I really hope that that is going to be uh, the case. Anyway, guys, it is the 23rd. Now, and uh, it's Christmas Eve tomorrow, I'm going to be busy tomorrow, I'll, I'll make sure that my uploads are done tonight, hopefully to get out for tomorrow, and make sure that you guys have a good, good Christmas. I'm hoping that I can get the old camera going, and I can, you know, film my exploits over the Christmas period, so that you guys have, have got like a, a sneak peek, really, into, into my life, not that you really need to know my life, or anything like that, but, you know, it could be interesting to some of you guys. Who knows? Um, and I really hope that you guys have a really nice Christmas and a fantastic new year. If I don't see you on Facecam before then, until next time, guys, until next year, I'll be the top man, as always. As always, stay safe. <laughs>